Hello, and welcome to Doctor's Corner. I'm Elvin Dahl, and today we're going to talk about a very interesting product that is going to help you in your health. And the product is Melipure Melatonin. Now, you may have heard about melatonin. Of course, it's one of the most abundantly sold uh, vitamins in the, in the marketplace for children and adults. But this one is different. This product is, is, a, is a wonder product, one of my favorites, and very, very powerful in what it can do in the human body, especially when you look into the studies. Melipure melatonin is, is, like I say, it's different from the rest. This is USP, pharmaceutical grade. It's patented. There's clinical studies based on Melipure, and it is vegan. The sourcing is completely different from what's in the marketplace today. I'll give you a little inside information on the price we pay, just so you can see the bottom line. We pay over $1,000 a kilo to buy our raw materials. But I can buy in the marketplace melatonin from China or the animal version from China for less than $175, roughly a kilo. So we're paying actually five times the price for our raw materials. And you may think, well, why are you doing that? That's a good question to ask because it's a lot of money, but the difference is in the quality. We were at a, at a trade show once and I was handing out samples of Melipure melatonin. And the panic look on this one woman's face, I'll not forget. She says, melatonin? I can't take melatonin. I get nightmares. I clench my teeth and my muscles go into a spasm. It's the most horrific experience I've ever experienced from a vitamin. And I looked at her and says, you know what? The exact opposite is what melatonin is supposed to do. I said, you're not allergic to melatonin. You're allergic to the sourcing of how melatonin was made. And we have had hardly any people react to, to melatonin. <laughs> Minimal. We're in the marketplace, probably about 25 to 30 percent. People have an aversion with it. You won't find that this way. It's because the product is made and takes a different pathway. It's made from fermented L-tryptophan, which is a known serotonin releaser. The others? Your guess is as good as mine. Even Dr. Braverman and Pfeiffer recommend to avoid as much as possible the animal version of melatonin. Because what it is, melatonin is secreted by the pineal gland. And then the pineal gland is what we call the third eye or your, your chakra. And this is responsible for your sleep-wake cycle. It's res responsible for setting your circadian clock on your 24-hour clock. It affects our mood. It affects our appetite. It affects our hormones, all from serotonin. Now, when you're stimulating this little gland, about the size of a pea, with a synthetic chemical that needs to first convert into a usable form, has to convert into tryptophan. And why would you take something that needs to convert when you can take something that's already in its natural state for absorption? It works wonders. And the other thing about it that I like, I take this pretty well every night. I take seven drops, which is equivalent to one milligram for anti-aging. The studies prove that it's for anti-aging. It just stimulates the, the pineal gland. And it's also the perfect dosage for children, especially hyperactive children or children that have a, a hard time to fall asleep. And the beauty of it being in a liquid form, it's great for those in palliative care. I had a discussion once with a naturopath at a trade show. And I was telling them the difference of the patented version and the pathway it takes is differently. He looks at me and says, what's the difference? 
As long as you're secreting serotonin, it don't make a difference at all. This is a naturopath, folks. Remember that. I looked at him in the eye and I says, well, if we take that logic, how about if you eat complete processed foods that's non-genetically modified? As long as you're getting fed, it's the same logic. But we have to recognize the source of even the food we eat, the water we drink, and the supplements we take if we want them to be therapeutic. I'll tell you a few things that we find in the marketplace. And these are people that suffer from a lack of serotonin. 70% of Americans suffer from sleep problems. 30% of these are women that suffer from insomnia. 23% individuals have difficulty concentrating. 30% have a higher rate of obesity. 40% of men suffer from insomnia, especially those on shift work. Very, very important to have your circadian clock in balance if you're working shifts. And 45% increase in depression symptoms from serotonin, lack of serotonin, and 15% in cardiovascular risk. Now, this is all has to do with the amount of sleep you get on a nightly basis and if it's disturbed or not disturbed. The beauty about this product is you can, it's so versatile. Even the American Cancer Institute is using melatonin, pharmaceutical grade, remember, for treating cancer. You can Google that. Now we have information brochures and it goes into the studies. So you can see the studies that have been performed using Melapure Melatonin. It's a versatile product, simple to use, great for children, and it will not shut down your own body's serotonin production like the animal version will or the chemical version. Something to consider, especially for something that's so enjoyable as a good night's sleep. I'm Elvin Dahl and the best of health.